one of the first phases of construction here they had to do is they had to create these 24 inch diameter holes. They're five feet deep and they're sinking concrete in there to anchor the main beams in there, the main poles. Based on our county's construction regulations, we dug a hole that measured 24 inches in diameter at a depth of five feet. Once we had all the holes dug out, we placed each of the posts into their respective holes. As a rule, the depth should represent about one third or one half the above ground height to provide maximum stability. Each main post is pressure treated timber measuring six inches by six inches. We used about four bags of quickcrete cement with the correct amount of water. We then added a layer of crushed limestone. Each hole has 50% quickcrete at the bottom and the other 50% we have the crushed limestone layer. They brought in a lot of concrete. So what they do to balance these beams is they put two by fours for support and then they level these out and they've got them all sunk in the concrete. So, so they use the bobcat here. Owen's oh, standing next to the bobcat. They use the bobcat here to level out the property. They had to bring in a ton of gravel. I had a little bit of a slope on my property and the gravel actually leveled everything out. What are you working on, Owen? I'm working on doing a hole. Don't fall. I'm doing a hole right here with my GPS. So as you can see by the drone footage here, we are making incredible progress on the barncade. It's um, the new version of Arcade Hollywood. We, uh, this has been in the planning stages for about a year. We set it in motion back in the summer and uh, it's becoming a reality. It's gonna be a 64 by 32 foot arcade building, TV studio. Um, it's gonna be a wonderful place. I can't wait to share it with everybody. We're gonna do live streaming from it, but take a look at some of the wonderful things that are happening in this barn build. Please like and subscribe to this channel and stay tuned. We will have a bunch of videos containing a variety of construction topics and a video update of the Barncade build progress.